We're converting this school bus into a tiny home and after three years of demolition, welding, cutting, and craziness, the finish line is in sight. We have about six more months till we hit the road and head to Utah and we still have a lot to do. That's for sure. <laughs> this weekend, we plan on finishing our front dash cabinet, also framing out the bathroom and the closet. And then we're gonna install the driver's chair, finally. We were unable to get the parts that we needed for the hydronic heater, so we're gonna push that off another weekend and focus on <laughs> the <frame> <laughs> <laughs> Eight. All right, first we're gonna build out front cabinet under the dash right here. Just finished the cabinet. Now we're gonna go eat lunch. We're back from lunch. We finished the cabinet, and now we're gonna try and put this driver's seat in. Woo! It's been about three-ish years since we took it out for the first time and mm -hmm. never put it back in. So it'll be nice to have that back in here if yeah. we can hook it up right. We can hook it up right. <laughs> about our situation <laughs> <laughs> well we brought in we brought back the captain's chair and originally we were planning on having our couch go from this line all the way until the dash ideally but the chair sticks out quite a bit so quite a bit. We are going to have to rethink our couch design situation. Yeah, Oof. that's all I had to it. Yeah, all right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put this. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm going to put this through the floor. <laughs> <laughs> and then you got to put the nut on and then hold it there so I can tighten it. Okay, and oh. then just hold it with the wrench. Yeah. Cool. I can do that. You here? Okay. Can you see this one? You can see it? Did you get a line? Okay, I'm coming. Okay. <laughs> so the thing is, I need that like, <laughs> you know? <laughs> Chairs in. <laughs> temporarily. Yeah, temporarily. Starting to put the uh, the flooring in, whatever that's gonna be. We don't know yet. Wanna cross it off the list? <gasps> All right, I'm gonna finish framing the bathroom. I think I'm going to attempt uh, to spray paint the metal thing that goes around the thing in the front. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing is, is that. This says use between 50 and 90 degrees Fahrenheit, and it is currently in the lower 40s. It's 43. So I think I might do it. And I'm not gonna paint anymore. <laughs> <laughs> too cold, it's too cold. So this is what we have done on the base so far, and we're just gonna finish it by putting some two by fours across these posts and then putting plywood on top. All right, let's see if it fits. 
Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So now we just have to put a piece of plywood on top of this and then we'll eventually put our toilet on that. All right, so we just finished up adding some framing to the bathroom over here. We got our toilet platform box thing built <laughs> <laughs> and we got some framing up in the closet. So yeah, exciting. Yeah, so we're pretty much done framing now. So we're all ready for next weekend. We'll buy some plywood so we can hopefully start putting up our walls yep. and hopefully I can finish the hydronic heater next weekend. Yep. So we got lots coming next weekend. Um, didn't get a whole lot done this weekend, but yeah, we were running a little low on supplies, and mm -hmm. we just ran out of screws, of course, too. Yeah, we gotta get more screws now. So too. yeah, we gotta stock up for next weekend and come in with a plan. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> in case you're wondering, this is the platform for the toilet, <laughs> and I still got his face. Yeah, that's crazy. All right, so that's gonna do it for this weekend. And we'll pick you up next weekend. Yeah, thanks for watching.